There is a little bakery shelf with some trays that have pastries on them. And they set right in the shelf like that. Everything looks really yummy. <laughs> I'm also going to be using some Play-Doh in this video to show you guys some different things that you can make. Here is a little bed. So this is probably Mimi's bed and this is Kitty's bed. That's what I'm guessing. And speaking of, here is Hello Kitty herself. And let's get her sister Mimi over here. Come here, Mimi. So here are Mimi and Kitty. <sighs> let's see what else we have. Sorry, Kitty. Here is a sweets cafe stand with an umbrella on it. And there's also a little rolling cart. And the wheels actually move. So, see how that works? So we could put some sweets up there too. There's a lot of cute stuff. Let's see what this is. This looks like a little counter and look at this. Doesn't that look like a cute little Christmas tree? Everything looks and reminds me of um, a gingerbread house or like a little house that you would see at the North Pole. This is a cute park bench with little pretzels and this looks like a cookie or a little biscuit. Here is another large counter and this looks like it goes in the house. There is a little menu board. It says Sweets Cafe <laughs> and lists all of the things that you can get there. Some little cafe chairs that look like they're made out of cookies. Let's see, what am I missing? Oh, look at this. It's a little, um, ah, a little tray with donuts. And way in the back here, oh my goodness, I'm dropping everything. There is a lamp. And here is a cute little table that has Hello Kitty's bow on it. <laughs> See, there's all kinds of stuff. So let's set up our little candy shop. I bet we can make it look really cute. Okay, I think I'm gonna start by setting up the balcony. And I don't know if you can tell, but one of the pieces of my balcony railing is broken, which is kind of a bummer, but I think I can kind of hide that. So we'll set this up, put a little flower on the table, and another chair. So we have a chair and two tables. I think that looks cute. And next we're going to set up the kitchen, and I also, um, I need to show you guys the colorful play mat that came with this. So. Okay, so we're gonna set up our kitchen. We'll put our kitchen counter in there. And some donuts. And two coffee cups. Whoa! <laughs> Those do slide out on little trays, but I got lucky because they didn't fall out. There. Next, let's set up the pastry shop.
And let's have Hello Kitty stand right here behind the cash register. And here's what we have so far. Doesn't Hello Kitty look so cute standing behind the counter in her little sweet candy house? And now we need to set up Kitty and Mimi's bedrooms. Let's put Kitty upstairs and we'll put Mimi downstairs. And here's something really neat about this little playhouse. The roofs come on and off so that you can easily move the characters and the furniture around. And when you're done doing that, you just place the roofs right back on top and they slide into place. Here comes Mimi with their cart. But where is Hello Kitty? Oh, there she is. Now let's play with Play-Doh. Can we, can we please? Did somebody say Play-Doh? Okay, so we are gonna start by making some heart-shaped cookies. And I'm just using this as my cookie cutter. So we have two little hearts to decorate. Now I want to decorate those to match the roof of the house. So I'm going to roll out white and then make some candy pieces. Okay, so here are how the cookies turned out, and now we just need to make little round balls of Play-Doh to look like candy. And we can use green, whoa, that's not what I meant to do, <laughs> and pink, and turquoise, and light pink, and we'll make some teeny tiny little balls. Now, everyone knows that playing with Play-Doh is fun, but did you also know that it's really good for developing the little muscles in your fingers that help you draw and write better? It's true. <laughs> and now it's time to decorate. And there they are decorated. Mmm, Amy Jo, those look delicious. Yummy, 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 yummy. <laughs> Thanks, kitty. Next, we're going to use some red Play-Doh and some white Play-Doh to make candy canes. It kind of looks like a straw. <laughs> now you're gonna wanna roll this out pretty thin and you wanna make sure that your red and white Play-Doh are stuck together. We're getting there. And once you get it how you want it, you just need to cut little sections And then you can form your candy cane. <laughs> Just like that. And here are five little candy canes. Okay, so we have cookies and we have candy canes and I have one more idea for Kitty and Mimi. Ok, 
Can you guys guess what I'm making them? That's right, Santa hats. Whoops, sorry, Mimi. <laughs> And once you get their hats the way you want them, you can use, whoa! <laughs> Hello Kitty kind of looks like a gnome right now, <laughs> but you could use the extruder to make the white fluffy stuff that goes around the bottom of the hat. And a little more for the little furry ball. And because it's Hello Kitty, we need one more thing. Did you guess that I was going to make them little bows? <laughs> Mimi has her yellow bow and Hello Kitty has her red bow. Okay guys, that's it for this video. I hope that you liked it. You know I love Hello Kitty, so this was a really fun video for me. If you'd like to see more Hello Kitty videos, you can click on the like button to let me know. And you can leave me a comment and tell me what your favorite thing was that we made out of Play-Doh. Mine was the cookie with the white frosting and the candies. For more fun videos like this, check out the rest of our channel. And if you haven't yet, we hope you'll subscribe. This is Amy Jo with DCTC. Thanks for watching.